President-elect Lai Jingna reportedly wants to speed up submarine production. Sources say that earlier this month, he asked for all seven planned submarines to be built in one go instead of in batches. Building them all together would require an increase to the national defense budget. DPP lawmakers have expressed approval, saying the change is in the interests of national security. Earlier this month, President Tsai Ing-wen and Vice President Lai ting de observed the delivery of the Yunlin patrol vessel. It was the first time they jointly attended a ceremony for a domestically built military vessel. It symbolized the handing over of a legacy. Today's ceremony symbolizes the progress in our domestic shipbuilding program, which continues to move forward. That same day, Tsai and Lai reportedly conducted a secret inspection of the Narwhal, Taiwan's first domestically built submarine prototype, receiving a confidential briefing. At the time, the head of the indigenous defense submarine program, Huang Shu Guang, and representatives from CSBC Corporation had proposed building the next seven vessels in three batches, in configurations of 3 plus 2 plus 2 or 2 plus 3 plus 2. With the May 20th inauguration drawing closer, Tsai deferred the decision to Lai, who asked for all seven vessels to be built in one go. This country belongs to all of us. Regardless of what happens in the legislative yuan, national security is not just an issue for the DPP or the KMT. Security isn't about party affiliation. Security is something we all have to work toward. So we hope that the program can proceed as planned so that submarine production can continue. But if Lai were to request additional funding for the additional submarines, he could hit resistance in the legislative yuan. Our stance as the ruling party is to complete the project as soon as possible. This shows our commitment to national security and national defense. The funds in the budget for the program have to be allocated properly. We hope that the opposition parties will also be committed to the same goals. We will only support transparent, corruption-free, and efficient domestic shipbuilding programs. We will support anything that is in the interests of the ROC. With tensions rising in the Taiwan Strait, the government hopes to speed up efforts to strengthen Taiwan's marine defenses.